In this tutorial, you will see how to convert PowerPoint to video for free using Camtasia. Though Camtasia costs $299, you can try it for free for one month, and there won't be any watermark on the final output. If you like it, then you can buy it. For the link, please view the, the description section. Open your Camtasia. Click Tools, Options, and then PowerPoint. Put a check mark in this box to enable the PowerPoint add-in, and then click OK. Now, open your PowerPoint presentation. Click Add-ins, and then click the round record button. This will open the PowerPoint slideshow, along with the Camtasia PowerPoint recorder. You can also record your voice while recording the presentation. Don't forget to ensure that the microphone is plugged in. Click on this button to start the recording. To pause the recording, you have to click Ctrl plus Shift plus F9. To stop the recording, you have to press the Escape key, or Ctrl plus Shift plus F10. Let's start a recording. Your PPT is being recorded. You can progress your slides by pressing the space bar. When you reach the end of the slideshow, you will get the pop-up, whether you want to stop the recording, or continue with the recording. Click Stop the Recording. Next, you will be prompted to save the presentation. After saving the presentation, you will be asked, do you want to produce the recording, or edit the recording? Yes, one of the greatest features of Camtasia is you can edit the video and cut out the unwanted pieces. You can also add zoom in, and zoom out, and many other cool transitions and callouts. Since we are just converting the PowerPoint to video, I will just produce the recording. You will be taken to the production wizard. You can even upload your video directly to, screencast.com or YouTube. But, I will select the custom production settings, and click next. Next, you will be asked to select your output format. MP4 is the best output format. But, now I will select WMV because I don't have an MP4 player, and I want to view the final video. After clicking Next, you will get a warning message box. Ignore that and click OK. Next, you will be asked to select the profile. I usually leave the default recommended selection. Click Next. Leave the default custom size. You can also type in your preferred custom size. You can include a watermark in your video by putting a check mark here, and then select the location of the logo image. Watermark is very important if you are going to share your video on video sharing sites. This will discourage others from downloading, and using your video. Ignore the other options. Click Next. Ignore the Table of Contents page, and click Next. Give your video a title in this box. Select a preferred output folder for your video, or leave the default selection. Leave the default selections for the other options. Play video after production, will play your video after rendering is done. Click finish. Let's wait until the video is rendered. Now, your PPT has been converted to video. The converted video will be played. Click Finish. Thank you for watching this video. To get regular video updates, please subscribe to our channel. We would love if you share this video.